this is what we're going to draw and this is how we're going to do it. Well, to draw a troll, we really need a kind of a bit of a plan first. And so I'm going to start, so this is the kind of where the feet are going to be. And we need to split everything up into around about f fives. So I'm going to take a measurement there and put that there and two, three, four and five. And I'll just make that a bit more obvious. And we want one, two, three. So in the third section here, this is kind of going to be the head and the hair will be kind of coming up like that. The body is about there. This is the sort of crutch, and the, so the legs will kind of come out to there, like that. And they want to be a little bit triangular at the bottom. So I'm going to start with this kind of little curve on the top there, like that. And then I want to bring it all the way around, like that. So this is your basic troll face shape. And then the ears are sort of starting about there, and they're going to come out and kind of round. Again, come out and round, and then they're going to come in a little bit down and straight up. They come in a little bit and down and straight up, and then you want this kind of little curve thing inside so he can hear what's going on. Now, this character is Branch, who is played by uh, Justin Timberlake and um, he has his eyes very close together. Now what I'm doing is I'm drawing the eyeballs like a kind of a letter C, so that that's the shiny bit uh, reflection, which might, kind of makes it look good. And he's got these quite serious eyebrows on the top like that. And then the nose wants to come really quite up close to the eyes. So you want to curve like that, like we started the head and then you want these curves which come around each side like that, which kind of echoes the shape of the face as well. So they're kind of coming up, and then we want quite a deep kind of bit that comes like that. And he's going to want, I'm going to give him a smile. I haven't seen the film, so I'm not really sure. Uh, he, these really kind of um, round teeth like that. So I done a lot of pictures I see of him. He's grumpy, actually. So I don't know quite what the story is. Um, uh, uh, but never mind. I made him look a bit happy. How am I going to... What am I going to make him look like? So I think I'm going to have him... One, two, three. Sort of like that. And then on this side, I'm going to have him... Kind of one, two, three. And then his hand to one side and this actually wants to come in and a little bit of kind of palm into the wrist there so he does have a wrist and then he's got his little jacket which is about there and his short trousers so what I'm going to do is so I am going to start by putting in this jacket with just these little loops like that so it looks like it's made out of leaves or something as I say I haven't seen the movie so I don't know the plot or the story or why they should look like this. Uh, and we'll just kind of put those in around there. And they're kind of a, a lime greeny kind of colour. And then that will be his his kind of short trousers in there. And we want a little curve there. And they'll come out there. And there are these kind of patches and things. So I'm going to put his thumb there. And then he only has three fingers. A lot of cartoony kind of characters like that only ever have three fingers. Because the fourth finger gets hard to draw. It makes it easier when you're doing animation just to have three fingers. You find Mickey Mouse, everybody has just three fingers. So bring that there, curve to there. And then the legs want to come down and then sort of curve out and one, and two, and three and four and then we can come that way as well with a little like that so that's kind of the top of his foot and again here this wants to come like that and one and two and three and four so he only has four toes and then we want to draw in the hair which it kind of follows this curve around here so it starts behind the ear and it wants to kind of flick up and then that will come around there and Flick up. And then, if you want to get this whole hair thing working, start in the middle and that will go straight up. And then we want to kind of split this whole area here, like that with a flick. 
and so we kind of split that in two and then here we're going to split this in two and then we want to do the same again here but let's not go all the way to the top because it gets hard to fit it all in there and just get it sort of halfway up into the space that you can fit it and then again you can do that here but only go half the way up again <laughs> And it just means you've got room to fit it in. And it also gives a kind of a shading kind of effect as well. Now, when you are sure that the ink is dry, then you can erase those pencil lines. So branch is this kind of strange blue color. I know everyone's going to want to know what are these paints I'm using and what's this brush? It's a Sakura Koi sketching set. And this is the water brush that comes with it. And uh, you'll find links to it in the comments box below. And we want a kind of a purpleness for the for the nose and I'm leaving a little bit of white there just for shininess and then I'm just going to add some kind of shadow and a very green limey green kind of waistcoat kind of orangey brown short trousers pants <laughs> if you call them pants in England where I live then pants are the kind of underwear uh, but I know in the states and other places what we call trousers you <laughs> you call pants. Of course, it's much fun sometimes. And then the hair, I'm going to paint up to there, and then I'm going to use the brush to kind of flick up to the top to make it look a bit kind of thinner. And there you go, how to draw branch from the Trolls movie. Thanks for watching, and you can support this channel and get so much more on my Patreon page. Click to find out more. Make sure you are subscribed to the Shoe Rainer Drawing channel on YouTube. And in the meantime, keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice. And I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye bye.